Hello. My name is Qin, Qin Wang. And that's a fake name. <laughs> I actually chose this name from an English book. It's called Chinese Name for Dummies. Uh, I know I look very Asian, but recently I found out that I actually have two person Caucasian DNA in me. Yeah, from time to time. That is indeed my white boyfriend. <laughs> See, my boyfriend, he works for Marx and Spencer's. Woo! So that two percent is not just any penis. The Marx and Spencer's penis. Uh, but now he's considering changing his job and work for Sainsbury's. Then I'll have to taste the difference. Uh, I am from China, and I've been living in the UK for seven years as a full-time immigrant. <laughs> so that's great. Give me a cheer if you're immigrant. <laughs> Give me a cheer if you're British. <laughs> okay, you don't sound happy somehow. Uh, during my seven years in, in the UK, I actually realized how weird is British people sometimes. <laughs> Especially the British government. Like, every time when they try to solve anything, the first thing they always do is to come up with some catchy slogans. <laughs> yeah. Like, last year for COVID, first we have uh, stay home, protect NHS, save lives, and then we have test, track, and trace. When I first heard of test, track, and trace, I thought that's your new immigration policy. <laughs> Gosh, I was concerned. Oh, phew. Yeah, to be honest, I'm not sure if those slogans are actually useful, but I'm sure they put a lot of effort into making slogans, and I don't want the effort to go wasted. So I actually created a system to make the slogans great again. <laughs> Here's the system. How to find out who did a stinky fart in the elevator? Stop, look, and listen. <laughs> and what do you do when you see your boss forgot to zip up his fly? See it, say it, sort it. <laughs> and what to do when somebody's trying to show off their ugly baby? Catch it, ding it, kill it. My, my trousers act is actually so tight now, I can barely breathe. Give me a cheer if you can wait during the lockdown. <laughs> For those people who don't cheer, liars. Uh, I get a lot of weight during the lockdown. The thing is, every time when I think about obesity, it always reminds me of my boyfriend. <laughs> no, he is not too fat, but he is too tall. And not just obesity, but vertically. <laughs> yeah, he's very tall. He's uh, six feet, 0.5 something. And I'm similar, 0.5 something. <laughs> so when we're walking together on the street, the scenery is quite dramatic. Like if you look from a distance, it looks like he is dragging a suitcase. <laughs> But if you look closer, then you realize, ah, the suitcase is made in China.
Lewis Chi!